My morale must be kept up high here, you know? Here's our fire we made. Oh, yeah. We walked past our Manoas. Oh, yeah, it's hot. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Look at this picture. There's some of these in reach of them. It's small. Actually, it's, it's more Texaco, which even Bianca had the idea of changing the word to Hexaco. <laughs> So it took more than not the word it was silly. Yeah, you, you should be Where do you get this stuff? Old magazines, old life fortune magazines. Uh -huh. I saw the word Fallout on some kind of poster. It must be some band called Fallout. There was a band over in England that was like made Fallout years ago. But I tried to get Fallout on all the license plate, but somebody in LA has got it. Uh -huh. It's probably their business or something. Yeah. It's my business. <laughs> I wonder, maybe they... Maybe wait if they ever keep it up. And... Yeah. Yeah, I should reapply and see if they can find it. <laughs> this is what I call real American art. <laughs> Real, Real American art, oh, not to be found in museums, not available on late night TV. Everyone's straight here. And you get not just one side of wonderful, vibrant, violent art, <laughs> but a second side showing a placid domestic scene, rich in material significance and symbolism. For materialists. Yes, <laughs> it reminds me very much of the upbringing I never had in the bountiful suburbs. We're looking for that tree, actually. <laughs> I have searched for this tree lo these many years, and yet it has eluded me. The holy quest for the money tree is one which any morally upright American would gladly undertake. I'd be happy with a money bush, you know, a money shrub. A money shrubbery would be fine, a little a, a, a potted plant of money. <laughs> would you settle for a money bowl that yeah, maybe sprouted spoke, dimes every, and nickels? Yeah, every year or two. But yet, century. why not reach for the highest branch you can, for the full blossoming money tree? That's the American way. Don't settle, my lad, for a mere bush or shrub. This is a bountiful country, and the Lord's bounty will fall and blossom on all of those. Now on t-shirts, now uh -huh. on t-shirts. Yes, you won't find this. It's all cash, and it's all yours. <laughs> you know, if the Renaissance masters had made t-shirts, art, their art would have been more appreciated. Yeah, if only Van Gogh had sold t-shirts, he wouldn't have died in abject poverty or despair. But did he think of that? No, no, no. He could have died rich. He'd still be dead. <laughs> he could have died rich. That's true. But he could have gotten on Oprah and Johnny and Phil and Merv. And he could have been a and celebrity. And heroin, too. If he had that much money, he could have gotten anything. <laughs> what couldn't he have gotten out of that much money? He <laughs> got on the streetcar. Oh. <laughs> Robert. Yes. Did I ever demonstrate my skill at rock throwing? Like how I could hit a camera lens? <laughs> From short range, too. <laughs> Blackmail. Oh no, it's not. It's not blackmail. Oh. He's not pushing a good commentary. He's not pushing a good commentary. He's not pushing a good He wanted to go there, and I wanted to go to Simple Pleasure. Why was Jason trying to find him? You know a man named Larry Thomas? He was really stressed out there when I tried to do it. Oh, yeah? That's good. 
Um, yeah, we went to Danube. I wanted to go to Simple Pleasures, but then we didn't, and that was cool. And then we went to the Cliff House to watch the water. Yeah. That was nice. I mean, we just had a really nice, relaxed time. It was, it was really nice. And, and I knew you needed some time, and I needed some coffee time and relaxing time. Pleasure to you know, yeah. last I really long. He taught undergraduate. Well, I'm glad he was home. Yeah, he he's so bummed out about him. Yeah. 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 Somebody should be making some money around here. I'll have to force myself to put the dog that way. I'll eat until I get sick. That's just the way things taste. Just this kind of strange atmosphere too, as far as the clientele goes. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> so different. It's very different. The tourist crowd. Like yeah, crowd and the very, the very. Um, we went weird. One time, Lance, and Kevin, and I had been down. We decided we had a day off. And I just got back from Europe, and we decided to go down to see Dave Warren. So mm -hmm. we spent, you know, an afternoon talking to Dave, mm -hmm. playing with him, and then we went up to the clubhouse to have a beer. We had just got in the museum mechanic and done photos. We're planning all this way. I think that Robert was filming. Don't run. Actually, it's on the phone. 